Yo, yo, guys, it's Lauren doing another video, and this right here is my Ring of Honor Glory by Honor 2012 predictions. Uh, the pay-per-view is this Sunday, and, I mean, this Saturday, excuse me, and this should be great. It's in Toronto, Arturio, Canada, so, yeah, great show, great show. So, first match we have on this card is Roger Strong versus Tedarius Thomas. Uh, I see this match going both ways, actually. Um, <clears throat> it's a feeling in my gut that Roger Strong will win the match, but... Then you have flip side here. You have Tadarius Thomas wins with a with a with a upset victory uh, with the assist from Michael Elgin. So I see both of that happening, but I see Roger Strong going over uh, here. So yeah, but uh, great way to bring in Tadarius Thomas though at Ring of Honor. I like his style. The next we have the Bravado Brothers versus Cedric Cedric Alexander Caprice Coleman CNC. Uh, finally, Ring of Honor pushed a black tag team. <laughs> but besides the racism, um, Cedric Alexander, Caprice Coleman, they'll win. They'll win this matchup. And I like the tag team. So, And I just feel bad for the Bravados. They just came back and they did the job for everybody. So I, I feel sorry for the Bravados. I think they should turn them healed and have like a side feud, a side tag team feud besides Whitmer and... Uh, Whitmer and Titus versus the World's Greatest Tag Team, which I think might be a match. So if they do have it, <clears throat> I expect the World's Greatest Tag Team to go over. So yeah. Then we the next match we have is for the TV title: Adam Cole versus Die Hard Eddie Edwards. Uh, Eddie Edwards doesn't need the belt, uh, so Adam Cole will retain. This. Especially, I expect the program between him and Matt Hardy somewhere down the line. Especially the way Matt Hardy was talking to. Uh, Adam Cole at uh, uh, Death Before the Sauna. So I definitely see a program uh, steaming between the two. Uh, the next we have Mike Mondo versus Mike Bennett. Uh, Mike Mondo is going to win this matchup. There's nothing to say about that. Mondo is going to win this matchup. If Bennett wins, it'll be a surprise. So yeah, Mondo will win. Uh, then we have Jay Lethal versus the uh, Die Hard Eddie Edwards. I mean, not Die Hard Eddie Edwards, but American Wolf. Davey Richards, excuse me. I get Eddie Edwards and Davey Richards confused all the time. I mean, it's just that. I'm thinking about one and then I say the other, so my bad. But Jay Lethal versus the American Wolf, Davey Richards. Uh, this should be a good matchup. I expect Lethal to win. Just like Lethal's been winning his last few pay-per-view matches. He gets the hell beat out of him for like the majority of the match. Then he gets angry, pops a stem, then low blows somebody <laughs> behind the referee's back and uh, hits his signature. So I think Davey Richards uh, is not going to win this matchup. Um, but if they do want to keep it mutual, like I think they might do, they should have this end of the screwy finish or something like that. So, like, have Kyle O'Reilly come out there and attack Davey and Jay. Maybe, I don't know. Because they were kind of like teasing the Kyle O'Reilly versus Davey Richards feud, too. So, hopefully they still have that. So, yeah. But, yeah, I do see Jay Lethal winning. But, if not that, I see a screwy finish happening. So, yeah. Um, Then we have uh, Scum, uh, Steve Carino, uh, Jimmy Jacobs versus uh, the Briscoe Brothers. I love the Briscoe Brothers just like everybody else. But, they're not going to win this matchup. Uh, Scum is going to keep the belts. This is going on. Uh, this is all going into the Kevin Steen taking over Ring of Honor and being this major badass. So, Scum are going to keep the belts. Um, that's all it is to it. Uh, am I many, missing any matches here? Uh, Rhino will probably be in action. Homicide will probably be in action. Hell, they probably have a match against each other. Uh, Tommaso Ciampa, expect something to go down between Tommaso Ciampa, uh, QT Marshall, R.D. Evans, and Chris Nana. Uh, a little spoiler here for you guys that watch the TV show. Uh, Tommaso Ciampa basically got dumped by R.D. Evans in favor for QT Marshall. And uh, Chris Nana came out there and, and head whipped him. <laughs> head whipped uh, R.D. Evans. So it looks like uh, Nana and Ciampa might be babyface now or something. I don't know. <laughs> so we only know when we see, but I expect something from them at the pay per view. And then next we have the main event. Uh, we have the unbreakable Michael Elgin challenging wrestling's worst nightmare, Kevin Steen, 
for a Ring of Honor World Heavyweight Championship. Uh, I like both of these guys. Uh, I've been impressed with Elgin's work this year. Uh, he's put on some good matches this year. Uh, however, he's not going to win this matchup. I'm sorry. Uh, Steen, are gonna, Steen is going to win. Um, the only two people I see Steen losing the belt to. And he's probably going to lose the belt at final battle. But the only two people I see Steen losing the belt to is one, Jay Lethal. And two, El Generico. One, Jay Lethal, because they're going on with this killer instinct thing that will build him up enough for him to fight Kevin Steen and beat him for the belt. El Generico, because Kevin Steen has did some horrible stuff from to El Generico ever since last final battle last year, uh, all the way to the uh, showdown at Sun Weekend. And, <laughs> I mean, he's just some pretty harsh stuff to El Generico. We haven't seen El Generico since, so they'll probably build that up, and we'll probably have that again. But, um, yeah. That's my prediction. Um, Kevin Steen will beat Michael Elgin. So, yeah, this is Laura. I do another video. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy the predictions. And peace.